You know, I just get so sick and tired of people treating us any old kind of way. And this shit is going to come to an end very, very, uh, very soon. Very soon. Anyway, I want y'all to hear this damn crazy story because it's so sad. And it just goes to show you how psychotic these this this nation is and the people that we have to share it with. A black girl 15 is sent to juvenile detention during a corona epidemic, a pandemic, for failing to complete her homework after a judge ruled that it violated the terms of the teen's probation. Of course, it's a white uh, judge, and she is um, a sick ticket from all... For all intents and purposes, this girl is, I mean, this judge is, it, you know, it rhymes with witch. Michigan student Grace, 15, was last year charged with theft and assault. She was subsequently sentenced to a strict probation. The judge ordered that the girl complete all classwork as part of her probation agreement. However, the teen struggled to complete her classwork after her school shifted to remote learning and amid the coronavirus pandemic. A judge has ordered Grace to spend at least three months at the Children's Village Detention Center. She was removed from the courthouse in shackles and cuffs. Grace will remain inside the juvenile facilities in Till a new hearing is set for September 8th. You know, somebody needs to go and take that judge's child and lock her up for anything. I don't care if she didn't do nothing. Lock her ass up. Because the way y'all treat people, and you have to be very narcissistic and, and, and have a severe personality disorder to wield your power at such a rate that you will put a girl in jail in the midst of a pandemic because she didn't complete her homework. You, my dear, are a bitch. You are the worst example of a human being. And they got you sitting on a judge to judge somebody. You are a judge. And right now, you should be judged. You should be judged in a position where you're not worthy of the position. Now, Grace suffers from ADHD. And that the pair began therapy. Um, the girl had began therapy after the assault. During sentencing in April, Grace tearfully begged Judge Mary Ellen Brennan not to send her to juvenile detention facility. Yes, my mom and I do get into a lot of arguments, but with each one, I learn something and try to analyze what happened. What teenager doesn't get into a confrontation with their parents? What teenager don't have arguments? Their hormones are, running, hormones are going crazy. It's hard being a teenager. She says, my mom and I are working each day to better ourselves and our relationship. And I think that the removal from my home will be an intrusive it will be an intrusive intrusion on our progress however now the schools are closed the judge's name is Judge Mary Ellen Brennan and everybody should write uh, I wish I had to uh, uh, God what I do with the address because this lady should be off the bench. She's not. She's a piece of trash. And she should not have the power. To do anything. Let alone. Put a child. In juvenile detention. And miss the coronavirus pandemic. Because she didn't do her homework. You are the worst piece of crap. I've ever seen in my life. You are poor, piss poor excuse for a judge, Mary Ellen Brenner. You rhyme with bitch, and you, no, you are a bitch, and you look like one. And what you've done to this child is horrible.
And if you had a kid, I wish somebody would lock her up. Giving our kids time and stuff like you handing out sandwiches. I'll see y'all in the next video.